this is Chicho. welcome back to my channel and uh, we're in fall 2017 and it's pomegranate season and the season this year has been absolutely magnificent and this has sort of become a, a yearly ritual for us i guess to sit down and have some pomegranates and this year seriously we've already gone through one bowl of pomegranates and we've got a I got another bowl here that I just topped out uh, last night. So let me show you this. And there, the season this year is absolutely magnificent, right? Like so good. And usually in pomegranate season, you end up getting, you know, if your supplier of the store you're buying it from, um, they're bringing a lot of pomegranates. It's a seasonal thing that they do. And I'm a firm believer in eating seasonal fruit. And, uh, if the store where you get it from usually brings in pomegranates sometimes they have two different batches one of them are the smaller pomegranates they're sort of not perfect and then they have the bigger larger pomegranates that are like perfect that are picture perfect basically you can put on display and stuff right and i've been sampling from both piles and both piles are absolutely fantastic really it's one of the best pomegranate seasons um i've seen for a long time right oops it's one of the best pomegranate seasons i've seen for a long time and i thought we'd sit down and enjoy a little pomegranates and um, what i've done this year is actually i've added uh, one more ingredient to the way i eat the pomegranates with a spoon as you know you know sometimes i make pomegranate salad dressing that we put up the video for already and it's fantastic it's unfortunate that pomegranates come out in the fall and winter because salads a lot of salads I personally end up eating usually in the summertime, right? In the spring and summer where you get fresh greens coming out. So I do eat, um, make the pomegranate salad dressing every now and then. I haven't this year yet. And I have uh, basically squished the pomegranates and sucked out the juice, had some fresh pomegranate um, juice as well. But the main way I've been eating pomegranates is in a bowl with a spoon. And just usually by itself, half the time, uh, well split between 50 50 half the time with yogurt pomegranates and yogurt half the time just pomegranates by themselves and uh, you know I guess that's a third of the time third of the time with yogurt third time by itself and a third time I mix other things in there and today we're gonna mix a little bit of things in there we're just gonna mix a couple of ingredients one of them is gonna be here let me show you I've been adding apples and apples I usually add apples are fall fruit they're fantastic right so this is a small green apple sort of cut up that I'm gonna throw in my bowl. Right. And it goes fantastic with pomegranates, really, really good with pomegranates. And then we're gonna bring the pomegranates big bowl here, and I'm just gonna fill up, well, within reason, right? So, like seriously, look at those. Those are delicious pomegranates, right? <laughs> Mix it in there. Right. That's two two big spoonfuls anyway three right nice one more and four let's mix this up okay as you can tell it looks fantastic it's amazing i guess fruit salad but it's just pomegranates and apples and mix it up right. and the apples that they're green they sort of start taking on the red color of the pomegranates. And it's a nice uh, nice combination because the pomegranates, the seeds are sharp and the apple is very, you know, it's nice and fibrous and mixes in with the, with the seeds really well, right? You can tell, right? The apples are picking up the red tint of the pomegranates. And this year, one thing I've been doing, let me show you this. I've been adding some organic cocoa or coca or cacao right however you choose to pronounce it and it's baking baking cocoa or baking cacao right so it's very uh, it's got a strong flavor you don't need very much i'm not going to add this much let me show you how much i'm going to add i'm going to add just one little teaspoon to the bowl that we have okay and it turns uh and I sort of spread it all around, right? And then mix it. And if I want more, I'll add more, okay? But mix it in. <laughs> and what happens is, you know, things start turning dark, 
like chocolate. <laughs> so you can think about this thing. Think of this thing as sort of uh, pomegranate and apple chocolate fruit salad, right? Uh, it loses this beautiful red color, but the taste, if you want a little bit of a chocolate taste, it's fantastic, okay? So that's what I've uh, sort of been munching on lately uh, for last month or so, because pomegranate season started about a month ago, or a little bit longer ago, but they're, uh, the pomegranates that first came out, they weren't that great, so I held off a little bit to binge, binge eat pomegranates uh, during the peak season when they're really just beautifully red and flavorful. Okay, so this is our officially our yearly ritual of eating pomegranates. Okay, and I usually try to grab at least one apple with a pomegranate with a spoonful of pomegranates, right? Seriously, very good. <laughs> Fantastic. It was like an explosion of flavors in the mouth.
pull it over and get the juices. Watch this. Nice, fresh power granite juice, right? Look at that. Nice. Very good. And just a little bit of more cocoa. Just a tad. Nice. Look at that. Pomegranate cocoa juice. Very good, very good. Thank you. 